Hello, my name is Dave Rodney, and today I'm speaking with Marcia Skyers James, who is Director of Sales and Marketing at the beautiful Kimberly Boutique Hotel in Midtown Manhattan in New York City. Marcia, why is the Kimberly such an obsession among discerning travelers? Well, I think when one travels, one wants to find a place that is clean and safe. But beyond that, you also want a place that makes you feel comfortable and at home with all the extra niceties. And I think that's what people have found here. At the Kimberley, uh, most of our staff have been tenured for years. And um, I've been here for 26 years, and I'm still junior on staff. And I think that people like the fact that when they come back, they see the same people. They're recognized and welcomed, and um, they, they just feel that they will be well taken care of. Wow. How long has the hotel been in operation? The hotel opened back in 1985. Originally, the idea was to build it as, as a, a, a residential building, but it opened as a hotel back in 1985. Any interesting backstories on the famous guests that you have welcomed here? So, um, in terms of presidents, we've had President Carter stay with us, President and Mrs. Carter. We've had, um, when he was, just after he left the vice presidency, Vice President Biden at the time. Um, we've had, actually, a wonderful time with uh, Bill Clinton playing the sax at Tattoo, so that was a big thing for us. And we've, we've also welcomed heads of state from many nations, particularly over um, the times of the United Nations General Assembly here in New York City. Amazing. Tell me, Marcy, about your accommodations. We have a variety. We have a total of 194 rooms. 40 of those are rooms, and the rest are all one- and two-bedroom suites. Um, the beauty of our accommodations when compared to others in the New York City area is that they're very spacious. So you're not going to run into a tiny little room at the Kimberley. Even though our regular rooms uh, compare very well against other rooms in the city. Our suites, are, our one bedroom suites anyway, are between 500 and 600 square feet. So you've got the living room space. Most of them have a balcony. They have a little kitchenette or a wet bar. So it kind of feels as if you have your own pied terre here in New York City. No, what's this talk I'm hearing about your beds being magical here at the Kimberley? You know, many people say that in the mornings they don't want to get up. I don't know if that's a good thing because we host a lot of corporate guests, so probably it's a good thing to be able to get up and go to work. But um, I think it's in the way that the bedding is done. So we have excellent mattresses. And then on top of the mattress is a feather bed. And then those are covered with um, wonderful Italian-made linens. And it just gives you this feeling, this very plush and, and comfortable feeling all the time. So that's it. People, you know, I've even bought a set of this for home. So it's, it's really very comfortable. Great. What about the dining options here? Well, for a smaller hotel, we actually have quite a few options. There is a steakhouse on our lobby level that's open for lunch and dinner. There is an Italian restaurant as well that's open for lunch and dinner, and they serve brunch on the weekends. And they have gluten-free options, which is quite a draw in the neighborhood. And then our rooftop, which is available year-round because it has a completely retractable wall and ceiling, uh, serves breakfast in the morning, stays open in the, uh, throughout the day for guests who want to probably just work and sip coffee from there. And then in the evenings, it, it is available for small drinks, uh, drinks and small plates. From our rooftop restaurant uh, upstairs, you get amazing views of the city, the Chrysler Building, the East River, the old GE Building. So when you stop there for drinks and small plates, you're not just enjoying the food, but you're enjoying the wonderful skyscape that New York has to offer. Your hotel is a favorite among Jamaicans. Who have been some of your famous VIP guests? 
and I see you lighting up. So, uh, yes, we're very grateful to the Jamaican community for the support. We have had the opportunity to host prime ministers. Uh, shall I name the prime ministers? Yes, so course. we have hosted Prime Minister Manley, Prime Minister Siaga, Prime Minister Patterson, Prime Minister Simpson Miller, Prime Minister Holness. So in addition to the prime ministers, we have also had some Jamaican celebrities other Jamaican celebrities stay here. So Sherry Lee Ralph lived with us for quite some time while she was performing on Broadway. We've had uh, recently uh, Spice has stayed with us. Chris Martin has stayed with us. We've had um, some sports figures. Veronica, Veronica Campbell-Brown has stayed with us. Lennox Lewis. Um, so, and we've had several ministers of government and members of the um, Jamaican business community who have spent time here with us at the Kimberley. How can travelers book private stays or groups here at the Kimberley? So, um, ideally, we like to talk to our customers. So, you can submit a form on our website to to, uh, to request group accommodations. But we also like to talk to you, so ideally you call us. Um, we have a group sales manager, Sarah, who would be happy to help you with any group accommodations. And we do everything from corporate groups to weddings, bar mitzvahs, the works.